のこの頭のことなんつった Sup guys, welcome back to another video, and in this video, I'm gonna be going over stand stereotypes, aka what your favorite stand says about you or what sort of player you are, alright? So if you enjoy this video, make sure to subscribe, and without further ado, let's get onto the first stand. Alright, our first stand on this list is King Crimson Requiem. King Crimson Requiem used to be one of the most underrated stands in the entire game, back when using vampirism and boxing at the same time was the meta. Its best moves are its raging demon passive. Time Erasure, Dimension Slash, and The Box. Yeah, I know, I pretty much just listed all of its moves, but they're all really good, okay? Did I also mention it has, like, the second highest base damage in the game? I don't know. If this is your favorite stand in YBA, it probably means you have good game knowledge and know how to abuse all of its combos effectively. If King Crimson Requiem was your favorite stand before it got nerfed, you probably used it just because it became popular for being a really overpowered meta stand, and you'd probably always spam the chop move. The next stand on this list is Higher From Green, and it can easily take the trophy for the cheesiest stand in the game. When I say cheese, I mean that this stand can require little to no effort to annoy your opponent. Its two most annoying moves it has are the Emerald Barrier and its Emerald Splash. Both of these moves have large hitboxes making it great for area control, but stands with the mobility moves like Time Skip and Stand Jump can easily counter them. If this is your favorite stand of the game, then obviously you keep it just to be annoying and you aren't too competitive in 1v1s. You keep this stand because you'd like to quickly delete people while using all of your moves at once. Alright, so the next stand on our list is Cream, okay? And this stand, this is the stand that nobody ever rolls for, okay? This is the stand that you're just rolling for whatever stand you actually wanted, and you got just as like a little backup, something you didn't really want, and you're probably gonna roke it in the next couple of seconds. Cream is one of the most underpowered stands in the game, as you can no longer spam both of your erasure moves at the same time, and one of them is blockable, it has practically a really low damage output, and it's easy to counter. And if you use this, and it's your favorite stand, then I don't know what to say to you, dude. Just roke it. Use something better. Anything better. Anything's better than cream at this point. I don't know why you'd keep it. So the next item on our list is actually a spec. It's the most popular mod spec. It's called Oni. It's really busted, overpowered, like all of the other mod specs. It has a lot of moves. All of them do a lot of damage, and they're really broken. That's all I gotta say. The next stand on our list is Star Platinum The World Requiem. If any of you guys are older players, you'll remember when Star Platinum The World Requiem used to be able to deal 3.9 damage if you're using Hamon to vampires. The insane damage plus the time stop on command and the aura beatdown made it the best stand in the game before it was nerfed into the ground. Nowadays, everyone knows how to counter Star Platinum The Worlds, and the only reason that people still use it is to watch the awesome beatdown animation. If this is your favorite stand, you're probably still learning how YBA PvP works, and what looks good on paper isn't always a good stand choice. Star Platinum the World does have time stop on command, aura beatdown, and stand jump to run away from enemies, but all of its offensive moves can be perfect blocked, it takes lots of skill points to have a good build, and it has virtually zero combos. If you do like the video, make sure you subscribe and leave a like, put a comment telling me that you did, because I'm just testing this stuff out. But if you did really like this, just like leave a comment, let me know, so I know and I can make more of these in the future.